Hi, everybody, and welcome to another edition of Endless Golf. I'm your host, Bobby Vermillion. Today, we're at Heritage Shores in Bridgeville, Delaware, and in just a moment, Director of Golf Brooks Massey will be here to show us around this beautiful Arthur Hills design, so stay with us. Welcome to Endless Golf with Bobby Vermillion. Endless Golf is brought to you by your local Toyota dealer. Toyota, let's go places. Discover Ocean City, Maryland. Book your Ocean City Golf getaway now at ococean.com. Geico, 15 minutes could save you 15% or more on car insurance. And by Pam's Ocean City Golf Getaways, the official golf package provider of Ocean City, Maryland. Joining me here at Heritage Shores in Bridgeville, Delaware is Director of Golf, Brooks Massey. And Brooks, it's great to have you back on the show. Bobby, thanks for coming out today. What a perfect day to talk about this beautiful Arthur Hills Design Golf Course located, as I mentioned, in Bridgeville, Delaware, only about 30 miles from Rehoboth Beach in Ocean City, Maryland. And it really is a great place to play in or in, on your way in town or out of town. But we must mention, this is a very active community with a very active membership. It is. We're a 55 and better community here. But as you mentioned, there's a lot of different activities on, on property for them to do here. Uh, Great, great place to retire to at the end of the day and have a good time. All right, well, this golf course is uh, definitely a challenging golf, golf course, Arthur Hills design. And when you take a look at the front nine, it gives you a chance to get started on a good note with the par four number one. Yeah, number one's not too tough of a hole out here. It's got a generous fairway out there. Uh, green slopes a little bit from back to front. As long as you're in the right, right section of the green, you get a good birdie look there on that. And then moving to number two, which is a very challenging par five. Number two, I think, is probably the toughest tee shot on the front nine for us. The key to that hole is on your second shot, because this is a three shot hole. Just stay ready to the 150 barber pole out there. And then moving to the par four, number three. Number three is a great risk reward par four. Their longer hitters can certainly get there if they want if the wind's down there. Uh, but again, you want to hit a hybrid and iron off that tee, tee box and leaves you a wedge into that green. And then moving to number four. Number four, really challenging par four there as well. Probably our, our toughest one on the front nine. It's got a two tier green. And depending on where our superintendent puts that pin position, really dictates that hole on the green from the tee box. And then moving to number seven. Number seven, kind of like number three, is a great risk reward par four. The average player can get pretty close to that green because it's not too far from the tee box. Again, the longer player could even maybe get there with a three wood. Probably the smart play, hit an iron off that tee box and you have a wedge in for your second shot. And then moving to the par three, number eight. Number eight is probably one of our most picturesque tee shots, especially from the back tee. It's 200 yards straight over water. From our up tees, it's off to the left-hand side, but a really generous par three. Good time to make a good score on that hole. Well, if you're fortunate enough to birdie number eight or make par on number eight, you're going to be challenged with the par five, number nine. Number nine is a tough hole. It's, it's really a three-shot hole. Only the longest of the long players can get there in two. But again, generous fairway. There's a, right, a left fairway bunker. You just want to stay right at that. And then your second shot's framed by water on the left-hand side and then the car path on the right. Just want to narrow that up, and you'll have about 100 yards in for your second shot. And Brooks, you have a great setting here for your pro shot right in the Sugar Beet Market. And uh, it's just perfect. You, you pull in, you're in the pro shop, and you can just uh, check right in and then start playing golf. A uh, great spot. We actually just moved in there this past November, but it's a full retail shop. You just, like you said, walked in there, you have the bar available to everybody. Great spot for our golfers to come in, buy a piece of merchandise for they head out or have a drink for they go out on the golf course. Let's talk about the hole we're going to play first today, and that is the par three, number 16, a very challenging golf hole. Number 16 is our longest par three on the golf course there. It, there's not a whole lot to it from the tee box, but once you get up around the green, we do have some bunkers that flank the front and right hand side today. Uh, biggest key is you miss that pop bunker on the right and everything flows down to the green. Well, we've kind of negotiated early today and yeah. decided we're going to play the blue tees, which is a little bit tougher. If I was playing the golf course, I'd probably play the whites for sure. But today we're going to play the blues, a little bit more of a challenge, yep. and it really is a great hole from there. Probably about a 190-yard shot, and uh, we'll see what we're faced with today when we get to the tee box. Let's see if we can't make a couple let's falls. Go, let's go hit a good one. Let's do it. Bobby, here we are on hole number 16. As we talked about earlier, it's the longest par three on the golf course. Uh, slopes from front to back. So really all we got to do is just keep it left of that little pop bunker and it should slope right down to the green. Yeah, that pin is tucked right behind that bunker. So I think a little more club here uh, is the play. A little into the wind too. I'm going to take an extra bat. Like I said, just try to get something chasing up there a little bit for us. Knock it on. Man, that's a good shot. I mean, that's right at it. Oh, that's I don't know perfect. if I'm going to hit that one again. I can't tell. It might have went in. <laughs> that's a great shot. Well, I've got plenty of club. And let's see if I can't knock someone on that dance floor. A little fade is the play for me here, Sounds if I can perfect. pull it off. Yep, let that slope take it from left to right up there for you. 
Good swing, Bobby. Hit it dead straight. Left side of the green. Just stay right there. A little short. Brooks actually hit a better shot than I thought from the tee box and almost got it to pin high. Um, you know, a lot of guys would chip this, but I'm just one of these guys. I'd, if I can get my putter in my hand, that's what I'm going to use. I think Texas Wedge is a good play here. All right. Let's see if I can't get it up there. Save my par. That looks pretty good there, Bobby. I'll take it. Yep, not a bad play at all. Well, Brooks, your ball never left the flag stick, and you've got a good opportunity to make a birdie here. Thank you. Yeah, went right over top of it. Uh, anytime you get a putt for two on this hole, I'll take it. In or out? Uh, go ahead and pull it out for me, please. Okay. Up the hill, pretty straight putt. Couldn't ask for anything better. Knock it in on a beautiful day. Good look and roll here. That just broke a little to the right. Oh, good putt. Thank you. The rest of that is good. You played it like Arthur Hills designed it. Perfect. <laughs> All right. Well, I've got one of these uh, five footers or so for par. Yep. Fairly straight. Yep. Not a whole lot in this. Greens are perfect. Great up and down there, All Bobby. All right. We'll Very take it. Nice. Well, 16, definitely a challenging par three. And when you walk away with two threes here, you're very happy. What a gorgeous day at Heritage Shores, located in Bridgeville, Delaware, just outside of Rehoboth Beach in Ocean City, Maryland. If you're on your way into a town, into Ocean City, Rehoboth, a great place to play, or your way out of town, you certainly can't uh, choose a better golf course. We'll be back and we'll play the par five number 18 here at Heritage Shores, so stay with us. Pam's is the biggest and the best. Nobody does Ocean City golf better. Tour the shore. This fantastic weekday October golf deal delivers some of the most spectacular golf courses in Ocean City. Play Baywood Greens, Newport Bay, Eagles Landing, or River Run at super affordable prices. Three round, two night packages start from only $285 per person. Call us at 888-222-GOLF. That's 888-222-4653. Or visit us online at tv.pamsocgolf.com. We'll do all the work so you can have all the fun. Walter, did you know Geico could save you hundreds on car insurance and a whole lot more? So what are you waiting for? World's strongest man, Martins Litsis, to help you break down boxes? What am I gonna do to you, box? Let me break it down for you. Oh! You're going down! Down to the recycling center! Hey, thanks, Martins. Hey, you're welcome. Geico. Switch today and see all the ways you could save. Toyota was named the best resale value brand by Kelly Blue Books KBB.com for 2021 with five models named best in class, including Camry, best midsize car, Sienna, best minivan, RAV4 hybrid, best hybrid car, Tacoma, best midsize pickup truck, and Tundra, best full-size pickup truck. For the best in value, there's only one place to go, Toyota. Let's go places. Welcome back to Endless Golf and Heritage Shores right here in beautiful Bridgeville, Delaware. Staying with me is Director of Golf, Brooks Massey. And Brooks, you had the opportunity to play the terrific par three, number 16. In just a few moments, we'll play number 18, which is a terrific hole here at Heritage Shores. This Arthur Hills design, you have a very active membership, and uh, if you're looking for a place to move to and join, I can't think of a better place in here to join. Yeah, I mean, we're definitely open to the public. We have two great membership options, our Diamond and Platinum program, and new this year, we established our Shores Card, which is a loyalty program. Gives some really good deep discounts. Again, people traveling in and out of the Ocean City area, really something for them to look into with that. And Brooks, in addition to having a great membership, you also host a number of great events. We do. We do a number of events throughout the year, whether it's golf tournaments, weddings, uh, work parties. We have a great amount of many. Sierra Clubhouse and Banquet Room can host any size event. We have our Passwaters Restaurant, our 1730 ta Tavern as well on property. And then our Sugar Beet Market is a great new venue for events as well. So whether you remember or not, you can enjoy this terrific Arthur Hills Design Golf Course. And I tell you what, when you turn to the back nine, 
you better be ready to play some good golf because there's a stretch of par fours that can uh, jump up and bite you, yep. and it begins with the par four number 10. Yeah, number 10 is pretty benign off the tee box there, leave you a, a shorter second shot in, but up by the green, water flanks that entire right-hand side. So again, safety first, stay on the left-hand side of that green. And then moving to a long par four, and that is number 11. Yeah, 11 is our longest par four on the backside, stretches a little over 450 yards from the back tee. Tee shot, again, pretty generous out there. Just want to say a little right of the fairway bunkers. And then the second shot will probably leave you a long to a hybrid into that green there. And then you get a little bit of a break with the par four number 12. 12 is very similar to number three and seven. The longer players can certainly drive that green, a little over 300 yards. Again, smart play. There's a little pop bunker there. Just carry that pop bunker. You'll have a wedge in for your second shot. And then Brooks, the par four number 13. Yeah, 13 is a tricky little tee shot there. You have water on the right hand side, so you want to stay left, but with the second shot, that gives you a tougher angle. So you want to cheat it just a little bit right of the barber pole in the fairway. It leaves you a good second shot in there. And then the par three number 14. You better pick the right club there. There's water lurking that can jump up and grab your golf ball. In my opinion, and it's certainly the toughest par three on the golf course. As you mentioned, water flanks kind of the front to the, to the back left of that green there. You don't want to be short because anything that hits that bank is going to roll back into the water. I always tell everybody to take at least a club more. That way you can go on the back side of the green there. And then the par five, number 15, probably your signature hole here at Heritage Shores. It is a pretty generous fairway. Again, you want to fit it between the water on the left and the fairway bunker on the right. The key to that is the second shot. If you have the opportunity to fly the wire that cuts across the fairway, do that because that leaves you a shorter third shot. If not laid back, you're going about 150 yards into a pretty tough green. If you par 15, you'll be challenged with the par three, number 16. Definitely a tough golf hole to play. 16s are our longest of the par threes here. Again, really the things that are the defense with that are the bunkers next to the green. There, there's a pot bunker that you want to try to miss. Try to take up the left hand side and let it run down towards the flag stick. Then the par four, number 17. 17 is unique. It's the only hole that we have here on probably with no water on it. Uh, fairway rolls from right to left there, so you want to keep up the right hand side. That'll leave you a flat lie. Again, a fairly short second shot there to a fairly benign green. And then your finishing hole here at Heritage Shores. The par five, number 18, plays its way back to the clubhouse. That second shot is really gorgeous, or the third shot into that green. It's just a beautiful setting to finish around. It really is. It's a great setting to finish it. You get to see the clubhouse on the right hand side, the sugar beet market where our golf shop's located at behind the green. Like you say, keep it up the right hand side. You'll have an opportunity to hit it into. Uh, the key is, though, make sure you stay right because water lurks on that left hand side all the way through. And the good news is we get to play that golf hole. So let's head to the 18th tee, see if we can't make a birdie. Sounds great. Bobby, here we are on hole number 18. Great risk reward par five to end the round. Um, goal here is we're just going to keep it the right hand side. Everything slopes down to that wire on the left. So I'm going to take it the bunkers there in the distance. Maybe hit a good drive and get a chance to get on in two. It's a fairly forgiving landing area unless you hit it left, right? Correct. I mean, it's a wide landing area. So like I said, we're going to try aiming up that right hand side and let the fairway feed it down to the left for us. Hit a good one. Thank you. Looks perfect to me. A little bit off the bunkers. That's yeah, that fine. should be okay there. Good shot. Good shot. Well, Brooks, if I can keep it on that line, I'll be in pretty good shape, that's for sure. So just try to follow your lead here. Sounds good. There you go, Bobby. Good drive All right, there. All right, we'll take it. Get down there. All right, Brooks, uh, no chance for me to get home in two, so just going to try to keep it in the fairway here, maybe hit it right over that bunker with a little draw and get myself in good position. Perfect. Yep, like I said, take it over that bunker. You'll probably have less than 100 yards left in. Or I can hit it left and get away with it. Stay right there. Stay right there. I'll take it. A little bit more aggressive than we won, <laughs> but that's okay. <laughs> Well, Bobby, we accomplished our goal from the tee box. We kept it just to the right of the water here. You know, typically I'd probably lay up from this spot, but we're on TV, so we're gonna give it a rip in two. Yeah, you gotta go for it in two from here. And uh, full disclosure, I don't think that water was ever in play for my tee shot, but go ahead and, uh, you're in perfect position. Go ahead and try to knock this on. Just a beautiful second shot into the 18th green. Yeah, I couldn't agree more. Clubhouse, sugar beet market in the background. Unique feature with this hole is there's a share, uh, square shaped green, so everything slopes from right to left. So we're just going to try and miss it right if we miss it anywhere out there. Knock it on, Brooks. That's yeah, right. Little right, right. The bunker. 
That's, right. a safe, that's a safe play, though, over there. Absolutely. Good angle coming to that yep. flag stick. Well, I'll tell you what, Brooks, as the saying goes, it's better to be lucky than good. I think that applies in this situation. Uh, I actually came over it, pulled that uh, second shot, but did not hit it in the water. And now I'm in perfect position to attack this pin. Yeah, actually, like you said, you, you're in a perfect spot. You're about 100 yards from the pin. Got a little ridge just short of it. Get over that, be a great shot. All right, let's see if I can knock it on. Kick a little left. Oh, not a good shot there. Well, Bobby, as we talked about with that second shot, uh, the miss was right, and that's where we're at right now. Doesn't leave us the easiest shot in the world, but hey, we've got a third shot into the green now. So I'm going to try to hit a high lofted one, see if I can't stop it. But again, as we talked about, the green kind of slopes away from me here, so we're going to have to hit a, hit a pretty good one to keep it close. Yeah, the pin is back, so we've got some room up there. Yep. Knock it close, Brooks. Good shot. Good looking shot there. I don't want to hit that one again, Bobby. That was pretty good there. Well, Brooks, good shot in there. You got a good look at birdie, and I just missed the green. Not a very good shot on my end. Uh, I went unconventional last time with the putter. I'm going to try to blade this 60 degree and get it rolling and knock it up there close. That's great, dude. Roll it like a putt and get it close up there. Stay nice, right there. Nicely done. I'll take it. Yep. A little aggressive, but you know what? Got a chance for my par. Got to putt back up the hill. You need it? No, I'm good, thank you. Okay, we'll take it out. If this pin was uh, tucked back left, and like you said, this square green, you can really see the square from here for sure. I was very happy with my third shot there. Left myself a pretty easy uh, birdie putt here. See if you can't knock it in. A little downhill, knock it in. One time. Oh, I got to hit it, I think, Bobby. One time. You hit All it. All right. <laughs> Good putt. Thank you. Good putt. <laughs> Didn't think it was going to quite get there. You know what? If you'd have left that short, I said I talked you into it because <laughs> I said how fast it was down the hill, but it was fast. All right. This is back up the hill and not a whole lot of movement here. Pushed it. And I got, yeah, away got away with it. I got away with it. Great up and down. You know, I think I hit, I think one good shot on that hole might have been the tee shot. <laughs> Still a part of the end of the day, right? Absolutely. A great four on your end, and I'll take five here any day. What a beautiful golf course. Heritage Shores, located in Bridgeville, Delaware, and Arthur Hills design, and really a great setting to play golf, and it really is a vibrant community. We've talked about that. When we come back, Brooks will have our tip of the week, so stay with us. Toyota was named the best resale value brand by Kelly Blue Books KPB.com for 2021 with five models named best in class, including Camry, best midsize car, Sienna, best minivan, RAV4 hybrid, best hybrid car, Tacoma, best midsize pickup truck, and Tundra, best full-size pickup truck. For the best in value, there's only one place to go, Toyota. Let's go places. We are thrilled. We finally found our dream home in the mountains. The views are great. The air is fresh. It is bear country, though. Hey, boo boo! We hit the jackpot. Bear, bear, bear. Look, corn on a cob. Ooh, chicken. Don't mind if I do. You're hungry. T-bone. That's what I call a smorgasbord. At least Geico makes bundling our home and car insurance easy. They do save us a ton of money. We'll take the cobbler to go. Good idea, Yogi. Now I'm smarter than the average bear. They're gone, Dad. For bundling made easy, go to Geico.com. Hi, my name is Stephen Fun, and this is my wife. Hi, Marjorie Fun. And these are the Fun Kids. We vacation in Ocean City, Maryland, because this town has our name written all over it. Fun, family of four, fun. We're the funs, not the borings. If you're looking for family fun, do what the fun family does. Book a week in Ocean City, Maryland. Go to OCOcean.com and don't miss free events like movies on the beach. Ask the Geico Pro, sponsored by Geico. 15 minutes could save you 15% or more on car insurance. Uh, 
I really don't know. I'm just, if you ask my parents, I was supposed to have a backup plan, but I don't know if I had much of one. Um, I could probably see myself doing it. I, I'd like to stay in the golf world in one way, shape, or form, whether it was coaching or as a swing instructor or an agent or something, but I would, I would definitely want to still be around the game of golf as much as I could. Hi, welcome back to Heritage Shores. We're out here on the 18th hole for our tip of the week. As you saw on the show today, I had a pretty tough third shot here on 18th that I had to carry over top of the bunker. Only way I could get that shot close was to hit a high lofted shot or a flop shot. So I wanted to give you just a couple pointers on how to pull that shot off. First is you want to use your highest lofted club. So I've got my 60 degree in my hand right now. Second thing we want to do, we want to add some loft to that club. So Normally we'd be square, we want to open that face up a little bit so it's pointing to the sky. Now that's going to help us hit the ball a little bit more into the air. And then the third thing, we want to widen our stance just a little bit. That helps us get our hands a little bit lower. That helps again produce a little shallower descent and it'll push the ball up into the air. And last thing, make sure we keep our posture through it. The worst thing we can do is lift up on this shot. That'll cause a skull across the green. So let's see if we can put all those together. Highest lofted club. We're going to open the face up a little bit widen our stance and take, keep our same posture all the way through. And as you see, that ball gets in the air nicely there, even has a little bit of spin on it. Great shot to utilize when you have to go over a bunker or any other type of hazard on the golf course. If this tip helps you, please come see our professional staff here at Heritage Shores or visit your local PGA professional. Walter, did you know GEICO could save you hundreds on car insurance and a whole lot more? So what are you waiting for? World's strongest man, Martins Litsis, to help you break down boxes? What am I going to do to you, box? Let me break it down for you. You're going down. Down to the recycling center. Hey, thanks, Martins. Hey, you're welcome. GEICO. Switch today and see all the ways you could save. Toyota was named the best resale value brand by Kelly Blue Book's KBB.com for 2021, with five models named best in class, including Camry, best midsize car, Sienna, best minivan, RAV4 Hybrid, best hybrid car, Tacoma, best midsize pickup truck, and Tundra, best full-size pickup truck. For the best in value, there's only one place to go, Toyota. Let's go places. Hi, my name is Stephen Fun, and this is my wife. Hi, Marjorie Fun. And these are the Fun Kids. We vacation in Ocean City, Maryland, because this town has our name written all over it. Fun, family of four, fun. We're the funs, not the boorings. If you're looking for family fun, do what the Fun family does. Book a week in Ocean City, Maryland. Go to OCOcean.com, and don't miss free events like movies on the beach. Nobody loves Ocean City Golf more than Bobby B, except the girls at Pam's Golf. Check us out at tv.pamsocgolf.com, where you can request a free edition of our latest Play Golf magazine, the ultimate golf magazine resource for planning an awesome Ocean City Golf vacation. Hey everyone, it's Mike Miller from Pittsburgh. I recently won the Pam's Golf Getaway Contest, where myself and six other friends were able to play four beautiful courses in Ocean City, Maryland. Uh, today we're sneaking out and uh, playing another 18. Pam's has been wonderful to work with. Uh, working with Sandra and Dana, they've given us just wonderful accommodations, wonderful uh, attention to everything that we've been looking for. We've gone to Star Restaurant twice, which is just phenomenal food. And for late October, early November, the golf couldn't be any better right here than in uh, Ocean City, Maryland. So make sure that you get Pam to call for your next golf trip. I know that I will, and so will my friends. Cheers. We've booked over a million rounds of golf. Pam's is the biggest and the best. Nobody does Ocean City golf better. Call us at 888-222-GOLF. That's 888-222-4653 or visit us online at tv.pamsocgolf.com. We'll do all the work so you can have all the fun. Here are some great upcoming events in Ocean City, Maryland.
find out more information about these great events, call 1-800-OC-OCEAN or visit OCEOcean.com. We are thrilled. We finally found our dream home in the mountains. The views are great. The air is fresh. It is bear country, though. Hey, boo-boo! We hit the jackpot! Bear, bear, bear. Look, corn on the cob! Ooh, chicken. Don't mind if I do. You're hungry. T-bone! That's what I call a smorgasbord! At least Geico makes bundling our home and car insurance easy. They do save us a ton of money. Well, take the cobbler to go. Good idea, Yogi. Now I'm smarter than the average bear. They're gone, Dad. For bundling made easy, go to geico.com. Toyota was named the best resale value brand by Kelly Blue Book's KPB.com for 2021 with five models named best in class, including Camry, best midsize car, Sienna, best minivan, RAV4 hybrid, best hybrid car, Tacoma, best midsize pickup truck, and Tundra, best full-size pickup truck. For the best in value, there's only one place to go, Toyota. Let's go places. Ocean City Golf Club, featuring 36 holes of championship golf. The beautiful Newport Bay Golf Course and the classic Seaside offer golfers two very distinct designs to choose from. Ocean City Golf Club blends spectacular views of the surrounding bays, woods, and wetlands with the enjoyment of quality golf. Come experience 36 of the most challenging and picturesque golf holes you'll find anywhere. Ocean City Golf Club in Ocean City, Maryland, changing the course of golf in Ocean City. Well, that's all the time we have for this week's edition of Endless Golf. From the beautiful Heritage Shores right here in Bridgeville, Delaware, a special thank you goes out to Director of Golf Brooks Massey and his entire staff for their wonderful hospitality. If you'd like to play this great golf course or a number of other great golf courses right here in the Ocean City, Maryland area, make sure you use Ocean City's official golf package provider, Pam's Golf Getaways. Until next time, I'm your host, Bobby Vermillion. Hit them straight. So long, everybody. Thanks for watching Endless Golf with Bobby Vermillion. Endless Golf is brought to you by your local Toyota dealer. Toyota, let's go places. Discover Ocean City, Maryland. Book your Ocean City Golf getaway now at ococean.com. Geico, 15 minutes could save you 15% or more on car insurance. And by Pam's Ocean City Golf Getaways, the official golf package provider of Ocean City, Maryland.